I think the the thing that has helped me most was the That's Leonor. I've been working with her for the past couple of weeks trying to fix her thoracic outlet syndrome and her scapular issues. And just like a lot of you, the strengthening has taken a very long time because I'm seeing results now and I've started with the strengthening exercises in July. So it's been 3 months. And that's why today I'm going to be showing you the best treatment to get rid of your pain immediately. And I'm going to be showing you why exercising isn't the best solution for immediate relief. Now this is part four of a mini series I've been doing with Leonore. So if you haven't seen the first three, then make sure to go check those out. If you want to see how we're able to get the results you're about to see and how you can replicate it yourself. How's everything going so far? How is the program? It's uh, going very well. Uh, I have, uh, I am very much better uh, at the moment. Let me just see. I just want to um, maybe hide this um, thing so I can see you. Um, no, it doesn't matter. All right. Um, no, I am uh, much better. I uh, the nerve pain is uh, really, really much lower than before. And good. it's been, I think, a good combination of uh, uh, the exercises that I continue doing and uh, some of the tips you gave me last time. Uh, I don't know if you remember, uh, we looked at some exercises that I did and you said, oh, maybe you need to work on this and this and this. And I did. It was mostly the right side that didn't move like I had a bit of winged scapula and then, yeah, it was a bit restricted. And I massaged like the rhomboid and serratus anterior and levator scapula and all of that and upper trap and it really loosened up. So uh, that's amazing. I feel like my right side can move freely now. And uh, Have you looked at it yet? Have you done a video on your scapula? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So uh, if you want, I can show you. Uh, yeah, let me just let me go to the screening real quick and make sure everybody's good on this. Um, I think it's good. Let me check security part. Allow part to share screen. I think we're good. Okay, let's see. What you can see now. So this I did just earlier today. Um, just some like movement to see how much I can move them <laughs> and the right seems really free and now it looks like very symmetrical that's yeah. good now, if you watch part three and then you would have noticed that she has a wing scapula on her right side but yet after two weeks later it's magically vanished and the reason why is because we worked on the one muscle that gets ignored the entire time the levator scapula if you want to learn more about that, then make sure to watch videos two and three because there's a lot of information in there all about this one muscle. But after showing me results, I didn't want to ask her more about what kind of changes she noticed after going through the program and what her life was like beforehand versus now. I think the, the thing that has helped me most was the different spots to release actually because the, I had already quite many exercises in place. So... Yeah, that's been really good. And uh, I've tried uh, only the first uh, fascia line massage. I want to do the second one as well. And that was really good. <laughs> yes. The, the fascia line is definitely a whole different ball game. <laughs> and it's like, oh, up here, it's like, oh, my God. <laughs> like small spots that you'll be like, ooh. <laughs> you don't think yeah. of this particular... <laughs> Yeah. So you mean before I started the challenge now? Because I started using information from your videos like in July. So what? what we can start from there if it, if it makes me look better. We can start from there. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> the biggest improvement was uh, since July because I couldn't do anything without a lot of pain. So starting to release the muscles has been the key to unlock the possibility to start doing stuff even like just this you know it wasn't possible at all before 
or just stretch the pec minor or whatever. It was just not an option. Nothing worked. So just starting to release some muscles really helped. So before that, to answer your question, sorry. Um, I mean, the pain um, was okay if I was very... Um, uh, if I didn't do much, I could like walk half an hour before I got pain. Um, I could, um, I, I couldn't like carry stuff. I couldn't do the dishes or like cut an onion. Uh, I couldn't hold up a book. I couldn't lift up my arms. None of that was working. I couldn't do most stuff really almost nothing um having the massages made it possible for me to be pain free when i was um inactive when i was uh, just not doing anything i would finally be able to be pain free and at first when i started to do if i did something with my arms the pain would come back but the massaging was, um, I think, the thing that relaxed the muscles so they could just sit down for periods without having pain or just walk a bit without having pain. Um, and I think the strengthening has taken a very long time because I'm seeing results now. And I started with the strengthening exercises in July. So it's been three months. And um, before I got some lasting results from the strengthening, like from the, you know, because the massages, I've been doing them uh, all over the place, starting in July with like the real uh, TOS muscles, but then exploring everything, the fascia down to the legs and the hips and everything was, I could like pull a bit on my hand and I would feel some twitching in my shoulder. It was, a, I was a big mess. So, but the massage really uh, released, like, made it possible to to finally move without creating pain. Um, right now, I can go swimming. I can cook a little. I can do some gardening and stuff like that. Um, what do you call it? clean the floor and it seems like small stuff but it makes a very big difference for me and carry some uh, groceries and mm. write by hand which was completely impossible um, not for long but uh, it's it's uh, really starting to pay off now, did you catch that? Because Leonor mentioned it a couple times. The key to feeling pain relief is massage. The key to feeling no pain with your movement is massage. And the key to feeling your exercises and actually getting them to fire up is massage. But to understand why this was able to work, let's take a look at how a physical therapist would fix a crooked tent. In this analogy, you have a crooked tent getting pulled in one direction by a shortened rope while the rope on the other side is getting stretched out. Now, if you're a physical therapist, your specialty is to strengthen the weaker muscles, and weaker muscles are the ones that are lengthened out. So what they would be doing here is trying to pull on that lengthened rope, hoping that it pulls the tent back up to a neutral position. Now, if you're a quack tyro and you see this, you're probably gonna be like, mm, let's just try to adjust this pull and hope that fixes it. No, okay, again, that's not going to work because again, the roach is gonna pull it right back out of place. Or if you're just a dumb sports massage therapist like myself, then you're gonna look at this and you're only going to look at the shorter, tighter side, the tighter muscles. And after you loosen all that, well, great, but now that tent pole is unstable and the only thing holding that tent up right now is that elongator rope. So what's the answer here? Well, it isn't one or the other, it's actually massage and training without the quacks.
And this is why my program is so effective at improving things like thoracic outlet syndrome. Because first, I'm gonna show you how to loosen all those tighter muscles like a massage therapist. I'm then gonna show you how to restore that temple back to its original position with passive stretches and mobility drills. And then I show you how to tie it all down by strengthening those weak muscles that complement the massage. And this is why hundreds, and pretty soon thousands, has gotten results in only 21 days versus three months. Now, if you wanna check out the 21 day TOS challenge, then I'll leave a link for you in the description below.